Lord of Hoare is silent. No more will he take her to the songs and laughter of Scotland's most popular ambassador. Thousands crowd Hamilton as Sir Harry Lauder reaches the end of the road. Seriously ill for many months, he had fought against death with the same vigor and tenacity that took him from a portobello mine to worldwide acclaim on the stage. Sir Harry's sister and his niece head the mourners who had come to Lanarkshire from all parts of Britain to pay a last tribute to the man who made millions sing. The Duke of Hamilton attended the funeral service and among the wreaths there is one from Mr and Mrs Churchill. Lauder's name will go down in stage history with the greatest of men.